Welcome to another segment of Easier Golfing. Today we're going to talk about how to hit a golf ball. Now, I want to make sure before we talk about actually how to strike the ball, that you watch your level one, level two, and level three swings. That's going to allow you to make the proper motions with your body to strike the ball well, but we're going to talk about how to strike it more solidly doing a simple drill. So this is my runway drill. What I do is I take three alignment rods. Two for the plane to take off and land, and one, we're going to pretend this is all water back here. We don't want to get stuck in the water. We want to make sure that we land the plane safely without dipping into the water and then losing all of our passengers. So our goal here is to set up where this alignment rod is about two club head widths behind the ball. Now we don't want it too close because we don't want it to fly up and hit us. We can also use a towel to be a little bit safer. But as you get better, you want to make it harder for yourself to make, a, make an error. So our goal here is to have the club swing down the runway on the way back, down the runway on the way through, and not to hit either of these rods. Then, on the way down, our goal is to hit the ball first so we don't want to hit that rod behind us. So another way you can make this work is use some tees on either side of the club head or a towel, like I said. Before adding a golf ball to it, let's go ahead and focus on just hitting the ground in the proper place. So two club heads would be where the ball is. You're going to set up, take some slow swings, really focusing on staying between the rods and missing the rod that's behind you. Gives you a good idea of how your body's supposed to move. You're going to feel your weight a little bit more in the lead foot at impact. Now, as you get more adventurous and better at this, we can tighten it up. We can move the back rod closer. We can move these two rods a little bit more narrow. But let's start a little bit wide at first. Just give yourself a visual to stay within a consistent space. Now, if you can consistently miss the rod behind you and the two rods off the toe and off the heel of the club, then I would add a ball. But if we're missing the ground consistently or we're getting really close to one rod or the other rod, keep doing it until we find some consistency. Because if we can't do it without a ball, we're definitely not going to be able to do it with a ball. So we're going to add the ball. Now our goal here is to make the same strike. So we're going to miss all three rods. So as you're doing this, really focus on the strike. The curve, the flight of the ball, not as important. Our goal is to miss all three rods, create some more centered strikes, hit that ball first and compress it. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at easiergolfing.com. Go ahead, click like and subscribe. And we hope to see you again here soon.